Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video we are going to see about Otalgia. Otalgia is nothing but ear pain or earache. Now let us see about the various causes of Otalgia. The causes of Otalgia can be divided into local causes and referred causes. The local causes can be further divided into external ear causes and middle ear causes. Now let us see about the abnormalities in external ear that can lead to Otalgia. Furuncle, impacted wax or impacted foreign body, otitis externa, otomycosis, malignant neoplasms of external ear, RP simplex or zoster infection, and trauma are the various causes that can lead to otalgia. All these causes are related to external ear deformity. Now let us see the various causes of otalgia due to a pathology in the middle ear. Otitis media especially acute otitis media, eustachian tube obstruction, mastoiditis, and carcinoma of middle ear are some of the causes th that can lead to otalgia due to a defect in the middle ear. Now let us see what are the referred causes of otalgia. Uh, referred causes, uh, this means that the pain arises not due to a defect in the ear per se, but uh, th due to a defect in some other causes but uh, due to the nervous supply of the ear, we feel or we perceive the pain in the ear. Now, the referred causes of otalgia can be divided into uh, causes due to conduction via the fifth cranial nerve, causes due to conduction via the ninth cranial nerve, causes due to conduction via the tenth cranial nerve, and causes due to conduction via the C2 and C3 spinal nerves. Now, let us see the various causes of otalgia due to conduction via the fifth cranial nerve. It can be due to a dental pathology. For example, a caries tooth or an impacted molar can cause otalgia. Or it can be due to a pathology in the oral cavity. For example, a benign or a malignant ulcerative lesion in oral cavity can lead to otalgia due to conduction via the fifth cranial nerve. Or it can be due to a pathology in the temporomandibular joint, for example, osteoarthritis and Costin syndrome are the various causes that can lead to otalgia due to a pathology in the temporal mandibular joint. It can also be due to a spinopalatine neuralgia. Now let us see the various causes of otalgia due to conduction via the ninth cranial nerve. It can be due to a defect in the oropharynx, for example, acute tonsillitis, peritonsillar abscess, benign or malignant ulcers in the oropharynx region or it can be due to a defect in the base of the tongue for example TB tongue or malignancy of tongue or it can be due to an elongated styloid process also. Now uh, otalgia can also be caused due to uh, a pathology uh, in a uh, vellicula or epiglottis, epiglottis esophagus or laryngopharynx. This is due to the innervation of the ear by the 10th cranial nerve. So via the 10th cranial nerve you can also get otalgia due to these causes that is malignancy or ulcers of valicula, epiglottis, larynx or laryngopharynx and esophagus. Now what are the causes of otalgia? Due to conduction via the C2 and C3 cranial nerves, cervical spine injuries uh, and cervical spondylitis can cause otalgia due to innervation of the ear by C2 and C3 spinal nerves. Now always remember that otalgia is just a symptom, so we need to find the cause and treat it. Thank you.